interest in coming to Hawaii was to surf, because that was what consumed my life when I was young, was surf. Good day is finding seeds. You know, we go to a plant that we know of and there are seeds to collect. A bad day is going somewhere and finding that, you know, the plant you were going to visit has died. Get your compass on you. Nope. Hawaii is being invaded by plants and animals from all over the world, and they are displacing species that have nowhere else to go. They're backed into a corner. We do know that at least 100 species of Hawaiian plants have gone extinct, so they're on the brink. It is the proverbial needle in the haystack, and there's no guarantee there's a needle in this haystack. But as long as there's a haystack, we're going to go through it. You never know, you get lucky, you find another one. Ah. You know? I see the flagging. Yeah. We've reached one of the three known plants of this uh, rare Alani. We've collected seeds a couple of times and no one's been successful in growing it yet. So we're going to keep trying till we get them. Let, let me just, whoa. <laughs> so these are, this is the seed capsule and well it looks like a kind of like a starfish or a court jester's hat you know when you work with rare plants you know you get to know them as individuals or i, I do i remember the day i first saw it and all the times you know i've come to see it and monitor it just see how it was doing. And it, when a plant like that dies, it's like losing a family member or a friend. It's, it, is, it is emotional, it, sometimes surprisingly so. We should do both sides, yeah? Okay. What do you think? Yeah. We go out and we look for plants. And when we find them, we try to get seeds and we bring them in to the nursery to be grown. And then when the nursery grows them to a certain size, we bring them out into appropriate habitat and create a new population. And so it kind of closes the loop by bringing the seedlings from the nursery out here and planting them. She's home. Be fruitful and multiply. <laughs> we just know we're one step closer from stopping something from disappearing from the face of the earth. And I just think we should do something about it. And we are.
Oftentimes I talk to friends and they'll ask, you know, tell them about a plant and they're like, well, what good is it? You know, can you eat it? Is it medicine? But to me, that's a selfish way of looking at the world is there has to be something in it for me. All species have a right to exist. They're forms of life that we share these islands with, that we share this planet with, and they should continue to live. <laughs>